13 Action News. Has there been an arrest? No. No arrest. A family is demanding justice four days after a Valley father is gunned down in front of his girlfriend and young child in an apparent road rage shooting. 13 Action News reporter Masa Saidi spoke with Joseph Jackson's loved ones and has their plea to you at home. Masa. Trisha, it happened at this intersection, Craig and North 5th. A lot of lanes, usually very busy, but it happened on Friday at 3.25 in the morning. We were with the victim's family tonight. They were in tears, including his little girl. They say whoever did this, this random murder needs to be caught. It's a loss, you know. It was a father, a brother, a son. Joseph Jackson was just trying to get to work, his girlfriend driving, when a dark colored Mitsubishi Eclipse almost hit their car. Relatives say Jackson yelled at the other driver. That's when someone in that two door car opened fire. There was more than one person in that car. Yes. Tonight, the family releasing new details about the suspects. Four in the car, possibly Hispanic. The driver, a young man with no facial hair. Jackson was shot and killed in front of his three-year-old. The little girl in the back seat yelled, Daddy got hit. How are his children doing? Not good right now. Devastated. Now the family living in fear, hoping for answers, praying for justice. Again, at Craig and North 5th, nearby this Shell station, Friday at 3.25 in the morning. The girlfriend that was in the car tells me the driver, his eyes were red. She believes he may have been under the influence of alcohol. If you have any information on this crime, they are pleading for you to contact police. Reporting live, Masa Saidi, 13 Action News.